All right. This came out like a like a like a day ago, something or two days from when I post this, maybe two to three days ago. Posted by Team Four Star, or made by Team Four Star, obviously. It's called Diesel Does Pilot TFX Originals, and something that kind of makes me like a little bit sad is the view count on this video. It's not nearly as no as the number of views of the the DBZ Abridged original thing that they did, which is around a million. And it's probably not enough as their actual Abridged series of the Dragon Ball Z. And uh, it is a picture. It's it's probably gonna get more popular, hopefully. But unfortunately, it's not looking that uh, that good. Hopefully, because this is original, they've obviously put a lot of work in this. This is obviously animated, and it kind of makes me a little bit sad that it, it, it didn't get enough views to probably like you know, compensate for the work they did in the front. Hopefully they did, especially with the patrons. They have patrons. Patron, <laughs> patron. Man, I say stuff weird, man. But enough of me rambling. How sad I am of their view count on this video. But and um, I'm gonna get it started. Yeah, let's go. Impress me, Team Four Star. I did it because no one else is going to. Oh, is that the voice of Android 18? That sound like it. I don't even know the voice actor style. I don't know the names. <laughs> I watched it. Yeah, it kind of sounds like Android 18's voice. Probably is a cool voice actor. It looks nice. The animation is there. Is this? I equipped her to deal with the world. I think this is 3D animated. See, yeah, man. It's not 2D. <laughs> Uh, we need a bed back there or something. Why? You're the only one sleeping easy on this trip. Yeah, that's why I need a bed. <laughs> well, pretty lazy, you've asked me. And I was not sure about the hair. <laughs> it was a little bit too bouncy and weird. <laughs> Sir, I have already given you ten you cannot have any more right now. Well, I want another one. Wait, you is work this? For me. So you quit. Isn't that uh, from uh, well, from the their Final Fantasy VII the bridge, the voice actor? Is this where it, where it takes place in? Because that was his voice <laughs> of um, uh, what's this called? The one of the <laughs> the gun with the hand. Was that just a reference? Reference because he had a hook for a hand instead of a gun. I'm not sure if this is, um, it may or may not be their the Final Fantasy VII Bridge original. It doesn't really say that. No, I didn't build her to fight. I just built her to be. So, what do you think? I think it's a good likeness. Great. I feel her voice is also from Come a bridge. Come on, Riley. Why do you have to be exactly no fun? How about I'm pretty sure that's like Jesse, the one fugitives. that died in from the law. Final Fantasy VII: The Bridge, the in like the first episode or something. Fun. That's all I'm asking. I think that's Look her. Look at Cadence. She's like maximum fun. I think that's like her because her voice is kind of. <laughs> it sounds <laughs> like hers, but it may not be. It looks really nice. Right. Why is this fun? Because it's kind of like we're famous. Oh, sorry for the burp. Wait, was that? That's a nice trick. Was that the shield that had the Team Four Star logo? Now, why don't you show me the one where the gorilla, the shrimp, and the pin cushions put their hands up and come quietly? It was you. What? That made her a fighter. Huxley, break for the truck with Riley. But All right. You're not. You got a better idea? Let's see if we can try to pick Huxley up the store on this. And you're or the door. <laughs> the two of you are the worst part <laughs> of this trip. And you know that. And that's the problem. Love you too, Sarge. Oh, are they in love or... Was it just... That's just a comment. 
I'm pretty sure that's the Team 4 Star logo on the shield. And score one for the blue column. Oh, no, wait, I think it's only three. Yeah, it's only three. God damn it. You messed up, Team 4 Star. <laughs> Was that a grenade or a, a landmine or something? <laughs> Oh, that's epic. Well, since that's blue fire, that was pretty hot. Don't start. No, stay in the truck. I'll be fine. Is that a robot AI? What is that? Man, this looks epic. <laughs> I wish I had the tools to basically animate because that's what I've probably been doing most of the animations on this channel, but I don't even have a computer. Alright, Private, clock back in. Union breaks over. Alright. <laughs> Too bad I can't understand what that. Uh, the helmet is saying. <laughs> I didn't even get their names. I'm sorry if they said the names, but I didn't catch it, I guess. Hobbs? Hobbs? Cadence? Is fighting for our lives. Cadence? Rebuttal. Sure it is. And no, she's not. And did you miss the part where I'm a full grown man and you're not my long lost dad? Plus, what is wrong with you that you don't think this is awesome? <laughs> Could you take this seriously for two seconds? I mean, it is awesome. She told Weapon to stay in the truck. How serious could it be? He's one guy with no back. Might be worth the one guy. Oh, that might be a problem. Hey, K Dash, how you doing? You doing good? Good, great. Listen, we gotta go. We gotta go, like, right now. <laughs> So that's Cadence, and that guy was um, Hobbs or something like that. Not sure about the other guy. Right. Also, P sure the, the maximum the watch on this is 720p. Yes, P. It's not 1080. Oh wow. <laughs> hmm. Nice fight. <laughs> Lame. Mom, he gave up. Ah, what a loser. Is she watching you too? KD? The Hoodie Ninja has an old Jericho and it's Cadence? on anything that moves mode. It's not super accurate though. We've moved like six times and the most it shot at so far was a cat. Of course. Wow. Phone taking care of that then? Would you? I'm on it. I just need a minute. Thanks KD. Uh, Huxley? Yo. The cat? <laughs> it's having a better day than us. It got away. Uh, oh. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I thought he meant that the cat died. I was like, oh shit. I thought I was like, oh no, they killed the cat. Fox. Fox? His name is Fox? Eugene! Eugene? You think something happened to him? I guarantee you, he's ignoring us. Again. Screw him. What are you cough about, man? Did someone get the plate on the truck that hit me? K dash DNC three strike zero one. <laughs> you drop this. <sighs> I know you think that's a good idea, but what about your friends down there? Hmm. Yeah. Are you hoping I don't know that your ship's targeting software is broken? <sighs> yep. <laughs> Alright, Buckethead. You got me. What now? 
You got to me. Ask me a question. Fine. I assume you're that new type order rabbit. So his name is Fox? In the metal. Why do they want you back so badly? Your card is worth a lot of money. I really don't know. Okay, then why'd you leave? I didn't. I woke up away from home. Why? I don't know. Okay, alright. Okay. <laughs> then where are you going? So was she set None up or your something? Business. And that concludes our Q and A portion. <laughs> it's like we have this new series. Here's a Q and A. <laughs> oh, you didn't just that. Okay. <laughs> Don't think about it too hard. It's a great day, Eugene. Eugene. So that's his name, not Fox, or is it just a code name or something? The small town of Vanguard is seeing some conflict today as three higher priority cards were intercepted by a hunter from the McKenzie group. Oh, hey, that's us. Why is this fun for you? Hmm. Are you seriously asking, or is this a rhetorical problem? <laughs> JD! Hey, brought you dinner. Ah, uh, Dash, have I ever told you you are my favorite blue robot? Load the truck. Did you steal that? I'm leaning into the whole being a criminal thing. Aces. And beyond another inch off my hairline, what do I get? Where's my chicken dinner? That was actually nice. <laughs> Getting the same gift all the time loses its punch after a while. Plus, we're forgetting that we still have to deal with Jesus. Whoa. Guess he's taking off. Let me guess. Worth it. Right? If I said no, would that really make you happy? <laughs> Cadence? One day. You're trying to nice your way out of the way the world is, is going to get us killed. Hmm. Whether you like it or not, the hard what days come. What is that radio saying? Meet your maker? You what? Know that. <laughs> it's just that one guy in the back. What? Hey, what are we doing just sitting here? No, we should really be driving. I know, cause, cause we're fugitives from the law. <laughs> All the laws. <laughs> well, that guy was cracking up. Yeah. What's that? Is our relationship? Like a father, a daughter, or something? What? What, what is this? Can't really tell. They haven't told me that much. Whoever she wanted to be, what she became was beautiful. Try and take it. We dare you. Like how the radio was just playing back in the whole time. Says something about make meet your your maker or something. That's the only part that I heard. Bunch of other stuff that I went over my head. Curvy design. Pop and second design. There's a lot of Mark White. I think that's called. There's the editor. <laughs> Scott Stephen Cliff. Stephen Scott. Scott. Special thanks, Ryan Forrest. Made in, in Blender. Hmm. Is that what this is? Was made in the models? I'm pretty sure that's the, the talking about the models. So maybe animated in in Blender. If I ever go in computer, I'm either going to do, I'm probably going to do Blender to make models. If that's what it is, <laughs> and sound filmmaker, SFM. 
or other programs that I probably don't know about because I haven't done that much research on them. <laughs> Mostly because I don't really need to because I don't have a computer. A computer? I have a phone. I know you can download apps to make like uh, models, but uh, not really much to make games. I know the I know there's like this one app, but I I have no idea how, to, how it works to be able to make a game with that app. So not really that like coding. I mean, to what? I probably wasn't like looking at it right. So yeah. <laughs> But man, this was, uh, yeah, some nice animation. I didn't really, uh, hmm. It shows some, like, pretty stuff, like, uh, some nice stuff. <laughs> Let's see. Hmm. So, the fugitives of the doll, hmm. she probably got set up or misplaced or, or lost or something. Maybe memory wiped, maybe, maybe, theorizing. And uh, they have to get there, these people. They didn't catch her name. Because I... Stuff goes over my head. And what else? What else? Uh, futuristic. <laughs> Let's see, the shield, yeah. Not really their weapons that much. Funnily, the shield was like... <laughs> basically like a force shield. And then you just have a metal... Metal machete, basically. Pretty sure that was a machete and not really like a like a sword, more like a machete. Which is not a good of a knife or a sword. Because it's one sided. You gotta get you gotta have a two sided sword, man. Two sided machete. It really is much better unless you just wanna slash or something, but that's probably not gonna be the best. But uh, anyway, this was pretty good. It was a uh, nice and <laughs> I wish it was a bit more longer to explain more stuff, but yeah. Mm, anything else I want to add? I think that's it. <laughs> well, it's uh as well made by Team Four Star. Great video that they made animation with Blender. Hopefully, I remember that they made this with Blender, so I can maybe potentially potentially make it with Blender too. My own animation, like weird animation. I do have like two animations, but they're fucking weird, man. <laughs> also, they didn't curse. They did a curse. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm the only one that cursed. Well, maybe. <laughs> anyway, it's been fun, y'all. But my name is Arcadis the Tiger, signing out. Bye, bitches.